hello guys welcome or welcome back to my channel it's jess today we are going to be doing a little cozy vlog i am very excited i have been wanting to do this for a while so we're going to be doing all things cozy like gaming reading and all kinds of fun hobbies that I have been wanting to get back into. I'm very excited. We are going to be starting off with gaming. Now, I already gamed with a friend. I did Fortnite and Nintendo Sports. So, I do have a Switch, by the way. And I would like to show you guys some of the things that I've gotten recently that I have been loving as a cozy gamer. Just kidding, we're definitely not doing that. But I do have to whisper because I'm doing an unboxing my parents don't know about. So we're gonna be unboxing the Nintendo Switch OLED. Let's get started. First of all, I got these thumb grips, which are so cute. Come on, like their little moons and Saturns and whatever. Cords. Oh, these are for the controller. We got the dock and I got a case and a micro SD card But they haven't come yet. They're gonna come today today at some point. So hopefully they do but We got the dock. This is the switch I had before the switch light <gasps> Damn, okay, I gotta set this up all right, so the first thing that I got was this sweater. I'll show you guys in a try-on portion because the lighting is a little bit weird today. But yeah, I got this sweater. It is absolutely adorable. It has Marie on it. If you don't know, I'm a very big Disney lover fan kind of deal. And yeah, I don't know if you could tell by my background, but yeah, I really love Disney. So that was something that I wanted to get for New Year's. And then I also got, y'all know I love my plushies. So I have this Alice Nuimos. If you don't know what Nuimos are, I did do a video on what they are and my collection. So definitely go check that out. But yeah, I have little Alice here. She looks a little bit like a ghost because of the lighting, but I swear she's not that ghostly in person. I also got a claw clip for my hair because I find that claw clips are better for my hair, which is very thin and fine. And then I also got my Nintendo Switch. I'm obsessed with it and I absolutely love it. It's perfect for gaming and it's just, I love this case. It also, the case came with this. So that should be nice, ignore the fingerprint. And then I got some more sweaters. I got this crew neck, which is absolutely adorable. It has all the princesses on it. And then I got this Ariel one. But yeah, those are some of the things that I've gotten recently that I have been loving as a cozy gamer who also loves Disney. Today, we are going to be doing some errands and tomorrow I actually have dance, so I have to prepare for that and stretch. And then yeah, today I'm just gonna be working and having a little fun with my little hobbies that i've been enjoying we are also going to be seeing a movie today if you don't know the hunger games movie is out and we're gonna be seeing that so that should be exciting but other than that it's gonna be a really chill day Thank you. 
Hi guys, there's still time, but we are going to the movies. The showing is at 6.20, so probably around 5 I'll get ready, but I wanted to show you guys what I'm going to be bringing in my little movie night fanny pack. So this is the fanny pack I will be using. Very cute, very simple, and it has lots of space. First thing, my wallet, my second wallet, clip, lip gloss, and my phone fits all nice up in there. And then for my accessory, I'm bringing my Daisy new emote. And there we go. That's gonna be everything I'm bringing. And I'll see you guys before or after the movie. It is now five o'clock. We're getting ready to go to the movie theater. So I'll see you guys there. Okay, ignore the fact that I look like a boy, but good morning, guys. It is the next day, as you can tell. Ignore this baby hair. I don't know what it's doing, but I just gave up on fixing it. So today we're going to dance, which is very exciting. I didn't tell you guys about the Hunger Games yesterday, so I will be talking to you guys about that. But first, we've got to get ready for dance. So I got my outfit ready to go, and then... Yeah, you can see me in the mirror, but yeah. So we're gonna pack my bag and yeah, let's go to dance. So we have my lip gloss. We have my lounge fly of the day. Nor my bed, it's kind of messy, but I'm gonna fix that later. So yeah, we have my lounge fly. Normally I bring a lounge fly cause I can put my shoes in and then we're gonna put this in here. And then all I have to do is pack my water and I think I have a snack in here already, so let's go to dance. Outfit of the day though, we have this sweater from Box Lunch, a shirt underneath from H&M, pants from Garage, I think. I have no idea where these socks are from. I think I got it for Christmas. So yeah, that's the fit. And yeah, ready for dance. I won't be filming me when I go to dance because just out of respect for everyone, but I will tell you guys how it went after. So I'll see you guys after dance. Okay, so I'm back from dance and it was really good. I really enjoyed it. We did a lot of turns. We did some balancing. We did tondus, if you guys know what that is, and dead flow plays. I could never say that right, but yeah. Yeah, that was really fun. I used to train like a lot more and then I took a three-year break and then I kind of just had to build my momentum after that so yeah it's been a journey but I'm glad I'm back at the studio and I wanted to share with you guys how The Hunger Games was. It was really good. It was a really long movie. I think there was like three parts and it was really good. It was really well done. It was very brutal. So if you aren't into brutal, like very dark kind of topics, then I wouldn't watch it. But yeah, it was... It was definitely not something I expected. I remember when I watched The Hunger Games when I was younger and I didn't really love it, but I think as an adult, I can appreciate the storytelling of it and the message behind it. So definitely was a different reader when I was younger. I don't think I was considered a reader when I was younger, but now that I am an adult, I love reading and I can appreciate literature as it is and how different authors have different styles, different methods they like. Yeah, it was very good. Right now, we're going to be celebrating my grandmother's birthday and that is very exciting we have made a whole hors d'oeuvres kind of meal so and we're gonna have our famous I, I don't know if anyone all my go-ins out there you know what sorbetel is we're having that and palau which is basically rice i'm very excited i'll show you guys like snippets of the food but like i'm not gonna be filming because i feel like it's just not necessary because it's my grandmother's birthday and i'd rather be present yeah if this is the last clip i'm going to do for this vlog Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!